Is it more important to level the crosshairs or the body of the scope? Let's take a look. So in this image, you can see that our scope body is shown in black. Our elevation and windage adjustments are shown in gray. You can see the direction of movement of our elevation adjustment shown in blue, and the comparable windage adjustment is shown in red. In the center of our image is going to be our rectifier tube assembly with our crosshairs. So as I move my elevation adjustment, you can see that my crosshairs are going to move vertically in line with my elevation adjustment screw. Let's say during assembly that our crosshairs were canted a little bit. So to keep our crosshairs level, we have now canted the scope body itself. So let's look at what happens when we adjust our elevation. Notice that not only did our crosshair move up, but it also moved diagonally to the left. What's that going to do to the point of impact? Again, we have to remember that that tube within the main body of the scope is going to move in the direction of the adjustment screws. So does leveling the crosshair really make sense in this case? What do you think?